Hey guys, welcome today to Herding Little Cows. This is part four, I think, of the hospitality series. And I just wanted to share today about a family that is very dear to us that has um, shared with us in many ways, even when they have very small space. Um, I just wanted to share about the Arnold family. Um, Catherine and Charlie are a couple that we met when we were living down in Key West. And at the time they had five kids, I'm thinking, four or five kids. Um, they are now expecting their ninth. Congratulations, Catherine. But um, I was just wanting to share um, my experience with them when we were living in Key West. She was very um, excited about homeschooling and about God. And so she, every week, had a group of us ladies and our kids over at their house down in Key West, which was the big, like they lived on the first floor of the their in-laws, her in-laws house, so his parents' house. Um, and she invited all of us into her house where most of us couldn't fit with all the kids in there because there just wasn't enough space. Their house was three rooms plus a bathroom. It was very, very small. Um, but she was such a loving person and such a wonderful hostess that we didn't notice how big the space was. The kids would run in and out through the glass door that they had to play in the yard. And we would just have any time to encourage each other in homeschooling and to talk about our week, to talk about what was going on in our churches as we went to various churches in town. And it was just such a blessing to see somebody open their home, even when they didn't have a whole lot of space to be able to offer that to other people. Um, then we've had other experiences with them because after we left Key West, they also did too. And um, they're now living um, in Tennessee. And we went to visit them on a trip we had taken to see my grandma. And they let us stay in their camper. Um, they again had a very tiny house where they were living in Tennessee, um, but opened it up to us, fed us some um, great meals in their small kitchen that they um, you know, took a lot of work to feed our whole family plus their whole family um, in the small space and let us sleep in their camper while we were there. And it was just so neat to see somebody who doesn't have a whole lot. Um, some people think they can't um, be hospitable because they don't have a large house. Um, it was just so neat to see somebody who used the circumstances God had placed them in to still bless the people around them. Thank you for joining us today.